Welcome. This is the energy vibration. Um, business, career, and finance show reading for um, the month, the year of 2020 for the Virgo. So Virgos, um, welcome. If this is the first time to my channel, please like, share, and subscribe. Share and subscribe. Um, these readings are for um, business people. If you're a freelancer or you are a professional business person, um, career person, um, these readings are for you, okay? So um, let's see what is transpiring. So what we're seeing for you, Virgos, is that definitely some of you are starting new jobs in the month of January. In the month of February, I see you're looking at new avenues where you can break in. Um, it could be that you have already have a business and you want to break out and you're looking for new avenues. I see some of you in the month of March is going to go in healing modalables or you could be doing psychic clairvoyance, uh, reading that sort of a thing could be coming up for some of you. Um, really, I see more of you Virgos maybe doing this as part time and Virgos are really psychic because... Um, what I should say, because if you notice in March and now, uh, March and uh, April, um, the psychic, the, these are two things. If you're a psychic, they always come up because that's a career of psychics, uh, clairvoyance and that sort of a thing, mediumship and that sort of a thing. Now, what I'm seeing is that a lot of you Virgos are going to be thinking about having a second job and it's going to be getting into that area. Um, what I would have said is do it from, you know, part time at home until you get bigger um, to do that sort of a thing. But I see this coming up for you, Virgos, and it's good because a lot of people is jumping and reading cards, reading cards and being a real psychic or um, a clairvoyance, clear audience, that sort of a thing. It's not for everyone. OK. People have intuition feelings, but not everyone was meant to read cards because trust me. Um, and when you're very good, you can know who, the people who are BSing and the people who just do it for the money or the people just think that they know what they're doing and they really don't know what they're doing. OK, so um, the Virgos are one of the best psychic Aquarians and Virgos. Capricorns, Taurus is not so because the Taurus is more of the business, but Virgos and Capricorns are really connect to the spirit world. Pisces, so it's like Virgo, Taurus is of no Virgo, Capricorn, Pisces, Aquarians. It depends on wh what if you're Aqu Aquarians. Capricorn, then you're very good at it. Fire signs are not very good at reading. Um, you know, their, their uh, mediumship and that sort of a shit doesn't come up. So Virgos, a lot of you are going to be going in the spiritual, deep, deeper in the spiritual. And I see you're being sent by your spirit guides to deeper in the spirituality. And that is going to be happening. So let's see what's coming up in the first quarter. Definitely, I see you connecting with your spirit guides. They're giving you messages. I see communications is happening in um, the second quarter. And in the third quarter, I see whatever the, the gossip is, whatever that was blocked, is going to be removed. Okay? So you see, Virgos, um, there was some issue we're dealing with. Um, Miskin, your psychic was blocked or miss, uh, maybe you weren't getting through to get work and that sort of a thing. The block is going to be lifted, okay, in the third quarter. So if you find out that the beginning of the year is not that good for you, in the middle of the year, the blocks is going to be moved at the third quarter. So in December 2020, you could see that now. What we're seeing is that people who have business or it's going to be starting business, is going to be having some wonderful 
um, success with their business the nine of cups okay the nine of cups so this is good January is gonna be a good month February is gonna be a good month depends on if you dabble in the spirit world and um, the first quarter can be very very good for you second quarter is more gossip jealousy that sort of a thing if you notice all the energies is in the reverse form meaning that uh, the eight of pentacles work situation for you guys might not be the good time or your skill might not be good or that sort of a thing is coming up in the second quarter is not looking that good okay the second quarter is not really looking that good for work career and that sort of a thing so let's see where is this happening and what's the blocks now some of you could be um, connecting in the second quarter to people and situation corporation that you're not feeling um, good working with so that is issues that could be coming up now the seven of swords is that some of you are going to be finding out deceptiveness that is going on around you on the work floor or with your project some of you are going to be finding that out then we see the energy of the moon um, where um, again the energy of psychic is as if your spirit guides are pushing you Virgos to become medium ships and work with the unseen because you guys are you Pisces Capricorns or and Aquarians depends are the best psychics okay um, uh, and and uh, prophecies okay so try that that is and if you are psychic um, in the month of uh, October it's gonna it's gonna be um, like spinning out of control let's see what is happening in January long-term stability in an organization so if you start a company um, or you start in an organization long-term stability is coming up okay and here again um, some good news um, about you know recognition public recognition um is going to be coming up i see people are going to be offering you help i see uh a lot of you on the work floor could be connecting i see offers is going to be coming in for you also and that is really really wonderful okay so um that is absolutely brilliant i see money so whoever is um whoever is thinking about you know looking for new um directions i see your spirit guides is going to alert you has some deceptiveness at play so that is going to be good wonderful energies is coming up for february and march really wonderful um energies um february and march your business could be doing very very well okay um that is uh, um good some of you are going to be finding out that you're connected in the right company because you feel at home it's as if you feel connected in that company and that is really good some of you could be finding out that by doing psychic works and that sort of a thing um it's there i see some of you could be lawyers um that if you're a lawyer i see you businessmen 45 years and older you're going to be very successful in december okay so businessmen 45 years and older your success is coming in december so that is good there's a lot i see a lot of movement a lot of forward movement a lot of people are moving forward I see a lot of success is happening so Virgos it is a new start whatever the blockage was with your career and your work this is really going to be lifted so that is good if you have your own business I see really a positive alignment of energies I see some of you are going to be um, regaining our new skill And this is good I see really positive news 
um, a lot of recognition, a lot of people, a lot of accomplishment. Uh, definitely a lot of accomplishments are going to be there for you guys. Career-wise, long-term sp stability is going to be there. But accomplishments is going to be like the keys that is happening. I see a lot of you businessmen in December is going to be very, very good. If you're a lawyer, your business is going to be... Um, very good your 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 practice is going to be renowned wow virgos this year it's not looking that bad i think what is happening virgos honestly because i see a lot of you whether or not you start your own business or you're doing your own business, Virgos, I see that whatever you start in January is going to make you a lot of money. Okay, Virgos? So whatever you start in January is definitely going to make you a lot of money, but there's also going to be a lot of jealousy. Also, it's going to be a lot of jealousy, but whatever you start in January is going to make you a lot of money, but it's also going to be, um, be a lot of jealousy. In the month of February, I see that you're looking for new avenues and new, uh, it's as if some of you, your ship comes in in January and I see you looking to expand in February and I see you're studying and you're going within and you want to know what decision to make but I see you are definitely definitely expanding your horizon I see um this is coming up as uh, listen to your intuition some of you could be stressed out some of you need to rest um, but listen to your intuition because some of you are going to be finding out something on about um, you doing some um, work, whether it's mediumship or healing, whatever way. But if you're doing that, I see you're going to be stressed out and they're saying take a break in the month of March. In the month of April, I see that you're going to be receiving a message in the month of April. Now, April is always the time of taxes, um, but I see some jealousy and I see some, you're going to be receiving some, whatever the message is that you're going to be receiving, you have to make a decision and you're, you're going to be like, no way. Okay. So. It, but it's evil. It's it's, it's 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 not positive. Um, and it could be positive, but I see you making some decision. But whatever this is, whatever this message is about that you're get, that you're going to be receiving, because it's just jealousy. Um, it's, it's you know you're doing well, so it could be something from the tax from the tax authority override or that sort of a thing. Okay, but it can be that. You're receiving a message from your spirit guides uh, um, to go in and try something new, okay? News is coming in. Um, good news is coming in. Some of you, um, if you are doing, um, your, some of you are going to be receiving some achievement, some, but it's as if people are loving what you're doing, but they're as if, they're haters and so it could be on the work floor that some people really liked you you're getting recognition um for the work that you're doing um you might not be very skilled 